Hey, Lake County, welcome to another edition of Celebrity Chefs with Cousin Vinny. Man, are you glad you tuned in today. I have a big, big, big surprise for you. Coming to you live from Cousin Vinny's Chicken Wings right here in sunny Leesburg, Florida. You know how the show goes. It's celebrity chefs, right? And usually I just have friends come on the show with me, but today I actually have a real celebrity. I am very, very, very pleased that God has allowed me the opportunity to meet this beautiful woman. Lake County, I bring to you our own Valerie Hart. Cousin Vinny. <laughs> Hello, Valerie. Hello, Cousin Vinny. Oh, my gosh. It's so I nice to see you. Last. I did you two years ago. You did me. <laughs> hey, this is PG me. now, Val. <laughs> Actually, when did we meet? You tell everybody. Oh, uh, it's been about two, three years, but we keep showing the show because you're so outrageous that I want to keep showing it. You are so cute. For all of you who don't know, on uh, Lakefront TV, Channel 22, I guess, on local channel, and is 199 Back of House. And 199 Bright House is Back of House, starring Valerie Hart and she's awesome so it's not for big giant corporations or big chains it's for little local businesses like mine so when I first moved into Lake County and opened a little restaurant I needed a little push to get going and a friend of mine over at Two Old Hags said boy I know what you need to do we need to have Valerie come and and showcase your restaurant and it really helped us and we took off so I love you for that and actually when I called you to do my show I was very much in shock I thought there was absolutely no way that you would be able to do it I can't refuse you Vinny, you know that. That's too, too, <laughs> too cool. That's, so what did you bring us today? Okay, this is crab season. This is blue crab season. You know, those right guys. That, oh, yeah. All right, cool. And uh, Palatka, they're pulling them out of the water, and you have to watch out for the, what's going on around there. And, cool. And live blue crabs are crawling all over the streets. Hey, if you're in Palatka, Florida, and you see a sweet little lady with crabs, just leave her alone. It's Valerie Hart. You can buy live blue crab in a number of places. One of them is in Leesburg at 44 in Maine, and there's a little guy. And you you can Put, you can pump him up if you want to tell him who it is. Well, Go ahead. It's, it's, he's, he's right on the corner. You can't miss him. 44 in Maine. And 44 in Maine. And live blue crab. And uh, they are crawling. And you have to be careful of them because uh, they're fierce. They're mean little guys. All right. Okay. We so, got, you got all your fingers? So, yeah. <laughs> okay. You, so, did you kill these guys or did you get the meat? How'd you do it? Well, I hate to tell you, I killed him for the newspaper column uh, that I did. And I brought him home and chased him around and purged them in the uh, salt water. Oh, cool. And then dumped him in the boiling water. But. There it is, the real deal. Are. This is one pound, two cups. Now, let's start with the recipe. You already have it to, that they can see it. Okay. Okay. But um, we're going to do uh, deviled crab. Okay. okay. I'm into it. I like All the way right. you said that. <laughs> you little devil, you. All right. Now, the first thing that comes into it is these are saltine crackers, okay? And they're mushed, whatever. Yep. But there's a secret to this. There you go. Just bang them out. Just bang them out. Do good. It the easy way. I'm glad you didn't bring something on the show we'd have to fly to New York to get. That's pretty good. I think I can handle that. Bang out some saltines. You can do it with your shoe if you want, but okay. don't tell anybody. Yeah, all right. Okay. And I noticed something, Val. You're the first one ever on Celebrity Chefs that actually wears gloves. So wh why do you have those gloves on? Because you're so such a good chef or something you were taught at an early age? Well, <laughs> um, it's an affectation. No, <laughs> I have them on because my grandmother always said to me that a lady should smell of flowers and perfume and not onions and garlic. So I wear gloves when I'm chopping onions and scallions and I all like kinds it. of stuff. Okay? I like it. Val, I'd all like right. you no matter what you smell like. <laughs> Seriously. All right. Now, here we go. And this is mayonnaise, and I'm using real mayonnaise. I'm yep. not using, you know, the fake stuff. Next on the agenda. Go ahead. What is it? Thank you. Uh, we have all these spices, which you can see in uh, whatever, and it's just an eighth of a teaspoon of everything. Now, salt. And I have in the recipe a teaspoon of salt, but it, it all depends what you want to do, okay? This is um, eight because I forgot my teaspoon. So now, that's You should ask me, we have those things right, here in we'll the kitchen. All right, we'll add more salt if we need it, but you don't okay. need salt with seafood. You really don't need a lot. It has its own iodine and stuff in it. Okay. Okay, now here's an eighth of a teaspoon of black pepper. Okay. No bam or nothing like that, huh? You're not. <laughs> this is Hungarian paprika, okay? This is what does it. it smells good. Oh, it is good. Oops. Just for your information, you don't have to go all the way to Hungary to get that paprika. So that's something you learn in cooking school. You know, I wouldn't use Hungarian paprika. I would just grab some paprika off the shelf. This is hot Hungarian paprika. It's different. Now, um, you can use cayenne pepper instead of hot Hungarian. The hot Hungarian cool. isn't quite as hot as cayenne. Gotcha. This is 
powdered ground ginger. That's also a secret. Okay? Cool. And a little lemon juice. Okay? I say a teaspoon of lemon juice. I like the sound effects. You're so cute. Hey, did y'all check that out, man? Valerie was like, boop, boop. I mean, if it was me, I'd be like, bam, throw that stuff in there. But you know what's Valerie? What are you going to do? What else do we have in here? I guess that does it. So that's garnish. Oh, wait. This, that looks this, pretty. This is Got to have the horseradish. Important. Yeah, horseradish. Oh, that's, you're getting on it. Oh, Putting yeah. a big one in there. Tablespoon. Oh, yeah. That gives it the real zip. Dump in your crab meat. Now, here's the important part. Right. When, when you purchase good crab, don't kill it, okay? What's that mean, don't kill it? That means don't mush it up so that they don't know what they're eating. Got it, got it. Okay, now. Same thing we do here with our chicken salad and our tuna salad. You know, and our, our chicken salad. Oh, your chicken even our wonderful. Even our potato salad. We don't want to mash yeah. the potatoes all the way down where right. it's mushy. You want to get a little bit of that, you know, when you want to taste the potatoes when sure. you're eating it. So. Sure, And this is why I'm wearing gloves now. Yes, well, that's true. All right. Yeah, absolutely. Although, I'll tell you something, a, a cook who washes her hands or his hands uh, all the time in your safety sink with 100 degree uh, water is just as good as the one yeah. who wears gloves. Well, you know, when you and watch... And like the kids in the fast food who scratch their heads with the gloves and then go and serve the burger. All right, Val, I love you. You mix that up, and okay. we're going to go to commercial, and we'll be back in two and two. All right, everybody, welcome back to LakeETV.com. This is Cousin Vinny. I'm so thrilled to have this wonderful guest with me today. It has been such a pleasure to have you, Val. You've just been cooking your little heart out over here. It smells great. Guys, does it smell good or what? It smells awesome. Something for everybody. It's probably. not chicken wings. I yeah, mean, but that's a problem. Probably. All my customers are going, what are you cooking in there? It smells incredible. <laughs> so these are crab cakes from Val. Val, you, uh, you teach cooking to charities, right? I think that's an amazing thing you do right here in, in uh, Lake County, right? Vinny, I've been, I've been doing this for like 35 years, and I'm doing what you're doing, and that is that the Lord has been very good to me, and it's my way of giving back. And I that's know awesome. that's what you're doing, and Always. I'm so proud of you. I mean, I really am. You are really nice to mention that. We do do a lot of things. We do pay it forward. We do feed families for free every month. I know. We do do charity events, and like you said, it's all about God. We give Him the glory for everything yeah. we do. So uh, yeah. thank you. And also, okay, now you're, you're the president of the Friends of the Library, too, right? Uh, nine years. Nine years doing that. That's because nobody cookbooks. else would take it. <laughs> <laughs> nine okay. years. Nine years. <laughs> And three cookbooks. So yes, if you sir. haven't, so and they're like yeah, books a million. You like you, your books aren't like right. They're big. You got three big cooking books. So well, we're really blessed to have you here today. It's so. a lot of fun. And now looky, I should have my gloves on again. Yeah, it's okay. So, but it's I just okay. washed my hands, so you won't tell anybody. Won't will tell you? anyway. It's okay. all good. It's all okay. good. We're okay. Okay. Plate this That's, up, and we're gonna okay. let everybody try it. Now they have the recipe for yes. the fresh corn, by the way. That's the important thing. Okay, cool. And they have the recipe of what to do. But now looky, if you want to cheat it as we all do. Yes, it's called Speed Scratch. You take a couple of things that are already made and put them together. I've seen it's it. It's from scratch. Yeah, <laughs> I've seen that show. Aren't this you? is um, sweetened... Uh, sweetened salad pepper. Sweet sweetened and hot, hot salad peppers. Salad peppers. Cool. Now, I forgot to chop them up, so right. we'll just kind of chop them up. this really pretty. And we're going to chop these up, and this is going in our corn instead of my recipe. Cool. Okay, but you know what? I'm just gonna throw them in whole today. Okay. They're just as good. Just as good. I drained them. Gotcha. Okay. All right. Now I'm gonna mix them all up. Now, as she mentioned, if you want the recipe for this, all you gotta do is come down to Cousin Vinny's for any one of our shows <laughs> and pick up the recipe. Oh, that's the deal. Well, that's the hook. That's so, that's that's what I get out of it. They gotta come down to pick up the recipe. Maybe I love they'll buy it. some wings. I while love it. Here. I love it. Yep. It's a win-win okay. situation. All right. Now, this is like your relish that goes that with it. That looks beautiful. All right. It's good. It does. It looks really good. It's now. good. There you go. Nothing fancy. And it, yeah, and it really wasn't that hard, I'm telling Just you. Just a true. little at home kind of thing, you know. Be careful. No, it really. Yeah. I'm a war zone, as you are. There you go. One crab on each plate. I like it. All right. And I am, this is cilantro. And this is an acquired taste. All right. For something. Something tells me you probably got that from, like, your backyard or something. Oh, why, of course. Of course. <laughs> All right, Val, listen. We're going to take this out there and let everybody try it. Okay. Can I get a kiss? Oh, 
God bless you. God bless you, baby. And uh, maybe you'll be, we'll be fortunate enough to have you back on another edition. Hey, it's fun to be on the side of the camera instead well, of interviewing you. All right, look into that camera right there. Hi. This is Valerie Hart, and this is Cousin Vinny coming to you. We appreciate you uh, taking a look at our show, and hopefully we'll get Valerie back in the future. So God bless you. Be cool, and hope you enjoy this recipe. Oh, All you. right, guys, it's a moment of truth. We're going to try Valerie's crab cakes. You guys ready? Yeah, We're ready. ready. I got a couple of friends with me here. What's your name, brother? My name's Tim. Tim, where are you from? Citrus Hill. And? Mike, Citrus Springs. All right, Mike and Valerie, I'm ready, baby. I'll take this one. That's the bigger half. Well, too bad. Just eat it. Y'all taste it. Yeah. Okay. I'm sure it's yummy. <laughs> oh, wow. Mm. That is great. Wow, that's good. She's a world-renowned chef, guys. Are you a happy camper? Uh, I'm a happy camper. Oh, good. I'll awesome. Love Vinny, you. I'll Very cook good. for you any day. All right, on the next edition, it'll be Rodney Griffin from Griffin Landscape, and I'll see you guys then. Peace.